integrity. The world is full of dishonest people and we all know that. We also know that it's not easy to find someone who has a lot of integrity. In this video, we will look at four stories that will show the need for one to be honest and a person of integrity. Number 1. The Flat Tire There's a story of four college students that stayed out too late the night before a midterm exam and missed their early morning class. The young men, realizing they'd missed the test, knew they had to come up with something fast for why they were late. So they rushed in to see the professor and told him that they had suffered a flat tire on their way to the class and pleaded for the opportunity to take the exam the next day. To their astonishment, the professor gleefully agreed. Sure, he said. Meet me here tomorrow and, understanding of your unfortunate circumstances, I'll allow you to take the exam tomorrow. Off they went, kicking their heels that the ploy had worked. The next morning when they arrived, the professor asked them to each go to a different room and then he would provide them with the test. The test had only one question, which tire was flat? Number 2. A Slanderous Tongue An old man was found to be spreading rumors that his neighbor was a thief. As a result, the young man was arrested. Days later the young man was proven innocent. After he was released he sued the old man for wrongly accusing him. In court the old man told the judge, they were just comments, they were not meant to harm anyone. The judge, before passing sentence on the case, told the old man, write all the things you said about him on a piece of paper. Cut them up and on the way home, throw the pieces of paper out. Tomorrow, come back to hear the sentence. The next day, the judge told the old man, before I hand down your sentence, you must go out and gather all the pieces of paper that you threw out yesterday. I can't do that, cried the old man. The wind spread them and I won't know where to find them. The judge then replied, this is the same way simple comments may destroy the honor of a man to such an extent that one is not able to fix it. If you can't speak well of someone, say nothing at all. Before we go to the next story, if you find this video interesting, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to the channel. Comment on what you think and any video you would like to see. Thank you. Number 3. Gandhi and Sugar A woman once came to Gandhi and asked him to please tell her son to give up eating sugar. Gandhi asked the woman to bring the boy back in a week. Exactly one week later the woman returned, and Gandhi said to the boy, please give up eating sugar. The woman thanked the Mahatma, and, as she turned to go, asked him why he had not said those words a week ago. Gandhi replied because a week ago, I had not given up eating sugar. Number 4. The Farmer's Chicken a butcher, who had had a particularly good day, proudly flipped his last chicken on a scale and weighed it. That will be $12.35, he told the customer. That's a good price, but it really is a little too small, said the woman. Don't you have anything larger? Hesitating, but thinking fast, the clerk returned the chicken to the refrigerator, paused a moment, then took it out again. This one, he said faintly, will be $13.85. The woman paused for a moment then made her decision. I know what, she said, I'll take both of them.